Okay, so this is a little guide here, or very fast guide here, of how to get the new exotic uh, Devil's Ruin. It is very simple. The way to start the quest, you have to go and complete one normal Sundial run. Not a heroic, just normal. Maybe you can't do heroic. I don't know. I've never done it. Don't know what the rewards are. Don't really care. But basically, just pick it up, and the next step, we talk to Saints, and we will pretty much head over there and see what he has to say. Alright, once we get to the tower, we meet Saint. He has this large text. If you want to read, you can read it if you want. But with the go to Twilight Gap, so basically that is located on the EDZ. So when you go to the EDZ directory, it'll be net over here on the bottom. If you don't have this risk or reward, it probably you've done it already. But, anyways, you clear it up, and there will be a dialogue with Osiris. Uh, Osiris, Saint 14, and Shax. I'll probably be talking over it every time. Basically, they find these time loss frames, which are just robots on the floor. I'll have I'll try to make the most efficient way to get to find them all very fast, um, very short amount of time. So I'm probably gonna skip dialogue and talk over dialogue. So if you want to listen to dialogue, I'm sure you listen to it when you're actually doing the time loss frames at the same time or picking it up to hit them. But every three you pick up, they have dialogue together, and then after when you finish the quest, they have that. It's a uh, Laura. Uh, Shax and Saint 14 has some banter with each other, so they and you if you want, listen to that. I listen to it on stream, so if you want you can go listen to that. But you probably if you want to do it, do it yourself. But I will not. I don't think I'm gonna record it. So I'm gonna find the most efficient way possible and I'll have that done. Well, that didn't work, huh? Alright, this is going to do a one take here, but here we go. So how this is all the locations of time loss fragments. You find these little robots in the area. So here is the first one we're going to find at spawn. So from the right of spawn, you follow this path. You should find them all. On up here. battle against the Fallen that took place here. It made Titans famous. Not in a good way. You say that like the Warlocks and Hunters sat on their hands. Get off this line, Osiris. I'm showing the Guardian something very important. Make me. <laughs> you would not survive that, but you made me laugh. You can stay. The fabled Yalahorns of legend were constructed from the armor of guardians who died here. Final deaths, all of them. What happened here wasn't your fault. Or mine. We would have lost if not for Shaxx's last stand. With Nkechi and Abdi, and Truth, Lifeng, Anna, uh, they all believed in him. He's more stubborn than you. Yes, sir. I have never known him to give up. Ever. Uh, he's taught me a lot. Yeah, that's all ten. Guardian, whether you wanted it or not, you and that should be it right us. there. That's that's it. It's really a short more quest. It's really that hard to do. You, I I mean I have the gun right now on me right now. It's pretty cool. Um we'll probably go over a little bit how it works. Might have been lost. I'll just finish the dialogue Save. here. I'm sure we do, if we do it too fast, I'm sure it's has to go through all the dialogue, which is, uh, pretty What's all fun. This? Guardian, there are no sanctioned matches at Twilight Gap right now. That's exactly what I was saying. Osiris! Warlord Shag says I live in breeze. Saint-14? I thought you were dead. Brother, I have always hated you. <laughs> <laughs> They'll be at this for a while, Guardian. Feel free to move about the universe. I'm sure you have better things to do than listen to this. Shags, the That's pretty much it. That's the step. They will talk for like two minutes, three minutes. But, uh, you know, if you want to listen to it, you can listen to it when you finish it. But if you want to listen to it as well, uh, it's on my stream. Uh, the VOD. Um, but yeah, we'll skip to Tripper Hall and see how the gun goes. Or what I figured out from it. 
All right, so Devil's Ruin has two perks that are unique to the weapon. We have Close the Gap, which uh, when you hold the fire button or trigger, you will power up a laser that can stagger and does damage over time. And also when you fully charge a tiger uh, laser, you refill the magazine from reserve. So what that means is that here we, here's what the laser is. So we have this uh, yellow bar here, charge it up. Does precision damage, also does you know normal body damage as well. Obviously it does more damage like that. And what it means are reserves, so if you were to, let's say, do this 14 times, and we have one shot left, charge it up, goes back to 15, takes 15 from the reserves and puts it back into the clip. So it it, it consumes ammo really fast. That's the one problem I've seen with it. So if you, if you do the if you do the 15 or 14 shots. And then you, oh, I messed that up. But if you charge it up, then uses the 15 instantly. The other problem is with it is that when you, you know, charge it up, right? There's no good way to stop the weapon. Like you can't like stop shooting. You have to like, uh, uh, change your weapon. When you do change your weapon, you lose all the ammo. So you don't, you can't just stop it midway, sadly. You, you use all the ammo or you don't, or you just use it, I, or you don't use a laser um but also it staggers as well uh unstoppable champions i don't know it does its decent damage in the crucible does about 50 the laser can one shot somebody if you hit the laser fully on their body and their head it does a lot of damage range has very bad range it has damage drop off so if i'm up close let's kill this guy first so kill this guy right up close you know like no more bullets it uses a lot of ammo um, 1788 and it it goes uh, the damage drop off not that far as you can see there it just it just gains ammo even if it's below uh, 15 so you get free 15 no matter what but it takes from the reserves but you will get that ammo back apparently which is pretty interesting to think about that um, but it does a lot less damage from afar but I don't think it has a range. I could be wrong. But it does a lot less damage. But it's just it's like a trace rifle, so it shouldn't have a range to it. But yeah, it, it, it doesn't hit that far. So that's pretty much the gun. I don't know. It's all right. Uh, Crucible, it's not that bad. Um, but I don't know. It's pretty gimmicky. It's very situational. So it's all up to whatever you would like to use it for but it is a really easy exotic to get it takes about 10 minutes to get i mean 20 minutes plus 30 if you or yeah, about 20 minutes with the sundial takes a bit of time to do so that's pretty much the gun hopefully that helps i don't know let's see